This layout pack has everything you need to get a car rental website up in no time. The seven unique page layouts are strategically designed, making it easy for visitors to quickly find and reserve the vehicle they need. The vehicle listings are clean and professional, and you're going to love the vehicle reservation forms and featured offers throughout. Now, before you can access pre-made layouts from the Divi Builder, you must first authenticate your Elegant Themes subscription. To do that, go ahead and go over to Divi, Theme Options. Then click the Updates tab. There, go ahead and enter your username and API key. And then click Save Changes. Once done, you should have access to the layouts without a problem. Now you're ready to start adding pre-made layouts to your pages. To do that, go ahead and create a new page by navigating to Pages, Add New. Enter a title for your page and then deploy the Visual Builder. You'll be prompted with three options. Go ahead and choose the one that says Choose a Pre-Made Layout. Now scroll down and find the Car Rental Layout Pack and select it. There you'll see all the different layouts that come inside the pack. You can just click on the one that you want and then select Use This Layout. Once the layout loads onto the page, don't forget to publish it. And that's it. You'll continue this process to create all seven pages with their corresponding layouts. And once you're done, you're ready to create your new menu. To create a new menu, go over to Appearance, Menus. Go ahead and give your menu a new name and click Create Menu. Go ahead and select all of the pages you just created over here on the left, and then click Add to Menu. Under your menu structure, you can organize all of your menu items however you like, and then go ahead and make sure that you select your display location as Primary Menu, and then click Save Menu. And one quick last step is that you're going to want to make sure and add a static home page to your website. To do that, you go over to Settings, Reading. And then under your home page displays, select a static page. And then for your home page, go ahead and find the home page that you just created with your new home page layout. After that, click Save Changes and you're done. Now your website is ready to go.